film about an American family on vacation in Austria. Um, they uh, have two 12-year-old uh, twins, and um, they're, it's a ski vacation in the Alps, and um, they're sitting outside in a restaurant, and all of a sudden there's a boom, and there's an avalanche very, very far away uh, that's been set off by the mountain, sort of a controlled avalanche. But what happens is that it gets closer and closer and closer, and for a moment or two, it really looks as if they're going to get nailed by this avalanche. Uh, and the wife in the couple grabs her two children and tries to protect them, and the husband in the couple, unfortunately, grabs his phone and runs away. And thus begin the mm. unraveling of the sweater of downhill. Yeah. I was blown away by the script. I thought it was uh, not having any knowledge of the, the previous uh, version of the movie, well, the original version. Um, I thought it was just such an interesting story, such an interesting uh, way to approach uh, a relationship movie. Yeah. And uh, uh, to add this external event that uh, that becomes immediately applicable to yourself, like how would I react? How would I react with my spouse? How would I react with my family? Would I do the right thing? And if I didn't, would I confess? Would I try to yeah. uh, d bury it deeper and hope that no one noticed? And because ultimately everyone's okay, uh, it just examines so many things in an interesting way. While while being funny, but but being dramatic at the same time, I just thought uh, I would I would die to get a chance to to be a part of this. Well, I play Pete, who's the husband, uh, and uh, he is uh, in real estate development. A real estate real estate development, very much into his work. I mean, I think very typical of a lot of us who uh, don't probably do the best job of putting their phone away and, and, and really living in the now and, and, uh, and, and really concentrating on spending a concentrated amount of time with their family. Uh, and uh, he, uh, he makes this knee-jerk decision to uh, abandon his family and, and kind of has to deal with the consequences uh, and behaves in a way uh, that is probably, it's not the best version it's not of too himself. Admirable. It's not too admirable. And, and it raises the question of, is this really who he is as a person? Or is he just, is, is he just hoping that no one will notice and that it'll just disappear and he's really not that bad a guy, but it just keeps snowballing? Um, we don't know. We, we try to figure that out as we as we follow the story. Um, I play Billy in the movie, who is the the wife and mother, and she has a career. She's an attorney. Uh, she's very. Um, I think she likes to think she's in control. Uh, she really uh, loves her husband. Uh, and is really eager to take this vacation and have it be uh, a tonic for the whole mm -hmm. family. They need, uh, they need this mm -hmm. getaway mm -hmm. as, a, as a family. Pete had, had lost his dad a few months prior, and it's been, you get the sense that maybe it was a slightly rough year as a result of that. Why wouldn't it be? Mm -hmm. and, um, and then when this horrible event happens, she is so shook up by it that she doesn't really know how to digest it and, and is questioning if she even saw what she saw. Hmm. We love working together, right? Oh, huh. Yes. Oh, is that not the case that we didn't like it that much? I, I mean, it, I, I had a good time, but I don't know. Maybe you didn't. Well, it, it was an honor, and it, it's one of the highlights of my life to work with Julia Louis Dreyfus. Are you looking into camera when you said that? Huh? Um, great. I'm so happy to hear that, Will. I'm so happy that you like she's working so, with me. She's so fun, and it, at times it really felt like I was arguing with my wife. Um. 
I'm so happy we made this film together.